Hello there everybody, welcome to BB14. This time we got 5 votes once again, the exact same as last episode. So thank you very much to the 5 people that keep voting and keep this show very consistent. So, we start with the immunity token vote like always. This is the first 8 member elimination since, what, 2 episodes ago? Anyway, 5 contestants received 0 votes. Those 5 were... Chase, Awesome Rider, Jeeves, Pirate, and Rex. George, Bumpy, and Shrek all received at least one vote. I can now reveal who won the majority. It was Shrek with three votes, while George and Bumpy only received one. Shrek is the recipient of this episode's immunity token. Moving on to the elimination vote, again, like last time, five contestants received zero elimination votes. Those being Shrek, George the Giant Drum Major, Bumpy, Rex, and Jeeves. Pirate, Awesome Rider, and Chase from Paw Patrol all received at least one vote. I can now reveal who received the most. It was Chase from Paw Patrol receiving three votes, meaning Chase is now the youngest balloon eliminated. The Chase balloon was made in 2017 and is sponsored by Spin Master and Nickelodeon. Was designed by Jennifer Palmer, manufactured by Raven Aerostar, is 43.3 feet high, 59.8 feet long, 36.2 feet wide and requires 90 handlers to guide him down the parade route. Chase was first on the case as a giant balloon in the 2017 Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade, journeying from Adventure Bay to Manhattan. The balloon features Chase in his signature navy blue police uniform, including a hat large enough to cover a real police cruiser complete with his trusty searchlight and net launcher, proving no job is too big, no pup is too small. The balloon sports paws larger than two full-grown Great Danes. Flying in from Adventure Bay is Paw Patrol's Chase, the brave rescue pup from the number one preschool series, Paw Patrol. Currently in its eighth season, this hit animated show produced by Spin Master Entertainment and broadcast on Nickelodeon features Chase and the rest of the heroic team of pups protecting their community and proving that no job is too big, no pup is too small. Families everywhere, including Charlie, will enjoy <laughs> watching the pups in their first ever theatrical film, Paw Patrol, the movie, it is streaming right now on Paramount Plus. The Chase Balloon returned in 2018, holding the honor of leading the parade lineup. The following year, forecast winds threatened to ground the giant balloons. Chase the second largest balloon as measured by helium volume, was to be one of the first balloons sidelined if winds exceeded regulations. However, they remained below the threshold and all balloons, including Chase, flew at a lower altitude. In 2020, the balloon was planned to be flown with a five vehicle framework that would reduce the number of handlers a measure put in place in response to the COVID-19 pandemic. As cases of the virus increased leading up to the parade, however, it was decided that any returning balloon would be shown virtually on the reimagined broadcast. The Chase balloon used footage from its previous three flights, promoting the summer 2021 release of the Paw Patrol movie. The Chase balloon returned live in the 2021 lineup promoting the streaming of Paw Patrol the movie on Paramount Plus. In 2022, the balloon celebrated the upcoming 10th anniversary of Paw Patrol and the fall 2023 release of Paw Patrol the Mighty Movie. Chase continues to make annual appearances in the lineup as of 2023 and is currently the oldest balloon still being used in the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade. 
the oldest still being used in the parade and now going to be the youngest inside the warehouse. We're gonna go there now, Chase. Goodbye. Well, that's the end of another episode and another more notable character being eliminated rather than someone obscure and black and white from the 1930s for once. Anyway, you know what time it is. It's time to get the wheel out and see who's up for voting next time. It's going to be... Group 25. Viewers, vote using the Google form in the description on who you want to win the immunity token and who you want to be eliminated. The person with the most elimination votes will be deflated and sent to the parade warehouse. See you all in the next episode.